Hello there, my wonderful friends. Welcome back. In part one, you'll learn two foundational exercises that are the cornerstones of today's powerful Qigong flow sequence. Remember the incredible energy we created in part one? We mastered those foundational exercises and you looked amazing doing them. Now, imagine taking that foundation and building upon it. In this exhilarating part two, we're going to unify those exercises into a dynamic and transformative flow routine. Think of it like creating a beautiful melody. In part one, we learned the individual notes and now we're going to weave them together into a powerful and harmonious song. So, are you ready to elevate your practice and unleash the power of Qigong Flow? If you're ready, let's flow together! Hello there, my wonderful friends. So first, let's settle down. And let's do a quick bow to welcome our practice today. First, let's stand in our Tanjong feet shoulder width apart. You can put your hands in the lower Dantin. Now feel your feet grab the earth at 10% tension. Release your knees, knees above the ankles. Release your sacrum, sacrum dropping towards the earth. And as you inhale, feel your spine connecting to heaven through your crown point. Relax here for a moment. And just simply connect to your own being connecting to your life source now let's begin some cleansing breath as you inhale you can feel your belly feel your ribs feel your chest and as you exhale exhale from the pinhole of your mouth exhaling as you release your chest your ribs and your belly try to exhale longer than your inhale so you can actually count as you inhale four three two one, and as you exhale from the pinhole of your mouth, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Now let's release our hands to the sides and let's begin to shake it out. Just completely let it go. Let go of any tension in your body, in your mind, in your spirit. Let go of anything that doesn't serve you at this moment. You can twist to the sides, squeezing out any tensions in the organs. And once we've completely let it go, we allow more flow to come in. So make sure you're shaking throughout your wrist, through every joint. Just let it go. No need to control everything all the time. Just allow this moment to just be. Release any expectations from yourself, for others, for this session. Releasing any expectation of what should be or what could be. And just fully embracing what is. Now you can slowly shift your weight to your right leg and begin to shake your left. Come back to center. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. Shift your weight to your left leg now and shake your right. And now come back to center. And begin to shake smaller and faster. Now as you exhale, hold the chi. Inhale, expand. Exhale, compress. Try to follow your breath here, listening to your natural rhythm and flow. Inhale, expand. Exhale, compress. Listen to your breath. And now I want you to hold the chi in the center of your palms, shift your weight to your right leg, and then open to wider than shoulder width apart. Begin to move your hips side to side. Keep your palms connected as you slowly lean forward with your upper body, continuously moving from the hips. Shift your upper body towards the left leg as you continue moving from the hips. Feel the deeper opening in the lateral sides of your legs. Now, slowly shift your way towards the other leg, doing the same motion, moving from the hips. Keep the palms connected.
Great, now come back to center. And now let's slowly rise up, moving from the hips again, slowly. And now as you come back to center, stand in your tanjong. Next exercise is looking up and down. So you're going to tilt your head and hips forward. And as you inhale, you're going to tilt back. So you want to feel that gentle elongation of the spine. Let's do two more. And now come back to center. Our next exercise is bowing to heaven and earth. Now open your right foot out at 45 degrees. Lift the left leg and then land your left foot to the ground perpendicular to the right foot. As you inhale, bring your arms up to heaven, elongating the spine. And as you exhale, bring your arms down, brushing your palms to your leg, flexing your front foot, folding from the hips. Just reach as far as you can here. Now release the front foot, brush your palms to your leg, extending all the way up to heaven, elongating the spine. Exhale, again, brush your palms to your leg, reaching to as far as you can, bowing to earth. Don't worry if you cannot reach your foot when you go down. Just simply go as far as you can, maybe reaching your shin or your knees. Just make sure that you're going through this motion at your own face, at your own level. Inhale, rising up, reaching for the heaven. Exhale, reaching back down to the earth. Great job. Now let's do last round on this side. Inhale now and come back to center. Great. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. Opening your left foot now out at 45 degree. Lift your right leg. Ground it to the floor perpendicular to your back foot. Inhale, extending upwards to heaven. Exhale, bringing it down, bowing to earth. And keep going, finding your flow and finding where this movement fits your body learning where this movement actually feels good rather than how it looks inhale rising up connecting to the heaven exhale grounding it back to the earth two more last one Rising up and come back to center. Let's come back to our Tanjong. The last Meridian Qigong warm up for today is opening the heart to the sky. Bring your palms up to your chest and then expand outwards as far as you can. Look up in the sky and open your chest. Release and give yourself a little hug as you rise up to your toes. Release to the earth and let's repeat. Inhale, extend up and exhale, compress and rise up to your toes. Let's do two more. Inhale. Expand, open your chest to the sky. Exhale, compress and rise. Release and last one. Let's go. Keep going. Follow your breath. Let it go and now gather your hands in front of you. Look at the center of your palms. Tap the back of your palms to your thighs. And now let's gather. Inhale as you circle up. Exhale as you push it down to the earth. And now let's expand to Wuji stance, listening to your inner energy or Ting Ting. You can close your eyes here. This is the moment where you allow yourself to simply be. To find that flow, we have to allow that flow. And for you to be able to allow something, it means you have to let go. Allow this to be a safe time and space to let go of all the things that no longer serves you. Now gather your hands back to your lower dantian, connecting to your life source. And as you connect back to your life source, to your own truest self, may this be a reminder that you have everything you need within you.
And with this, we will begin our flow. So again, if you haven't watched the first part of this video, I recommend that you do so because in today's practice, we're going to focus on flowing and combining the two exercises. Now let's begin drag and whip sit tail, shift your weight to your right leg, lift your left and open to wider than shoulder width apart. As you sink down to your core stance, begin to gather your palms, begin your wave, gather to your lower dantian. Start flowing, focusing on the lower dantian first. As you do this movement, feel the energy of heaven and earth connect to your body. Remember your wellspring palms, carrying the chi ball in the center of your palms. Let's do one more, focusing on the lower dantian. And now in the next round, let's focus on the middle dantian, gathering your palms around the chest area. Still doing your wave. Connecting the energy from the ground up. Let's do two more focusing on the middle dantian. Now let's begin to bring our palms towards the upper dantian. Let's do three more focusing on the upper dantian. Great, now let's bring it back down to the middle dantian. One more time, gathering it in the middle dantian. And now let's gather it in the lower dantian. Awesome, now let's close back in our Tan Chong, circling it up as you inhale and exhale, bringing it down to the earth. Great job everyone, now we're slowly finding our flow. Now let's practice the next exercise, which is the Tiger Qigong. I hope that you guys remember it. And if not, it's fine, just find your flow. Shifting our weight to your right leg and then open to wider than shoulder width apart. Swing your arms into your tiger's claw, open your chest and push forward. Tilting your shoulders and hips, rotate your tiger's claw and gather it back in. Open your chest and now we're going to push back our tiger's claw. Rotate the claws, scoop it in and gather it back into our strong tiger form. Let's do three more rounds. Try to find your flow. Push forward. Rotate your tiger's claw. Bring it in. Hold this pose. And push it back. Rotate the tiger's claw. Scoop it in. Hold it here. And again, last two rounds. Push it back. Rotate and bring it in. Hold the peak position of the tiger. Keep it strong and let it go. Push forward. Rotate. Bring it back in. Hold it. And now push it back. Last time, scoop it in. And hold. Keep it strong. And push it forward. Now let go of your tiger's claw. Bring it in. Back into your tunchong. Push forward and bring it back down to the earth. Great job. Now let's close one time for this round. Inhale as you circle up. Exhale as you bring it down to the earth. You did a wonderful job, my friends. And now before we begin our flow, let's go back to stillness for a little while. Opening up to Wuchi's dance. Taking this moment and time to understand what just happened. Understanding our energy flow. Listening and simply being. Now let's put our hands back in our lower dantian, gathering the energy back into our lower dantian before we begin our flow. Take this time to digest what you need to learn and unlearn, and maybe even recall and remember whatever you need to get ready for the next round. All right now, my friends, let's slowly open our eyes and let's begin our qigong flow for the day. So we're going to put together the dragon whips its tail in the tiger qigong. We will begin first with the tiger qigong, and then we'll flow it out and connect it to dragon whips its tail. Ready? Now let's begin. Shift your weight to your right leg, open to wider than shoulder width apart. 
gather into your tiger's claw push it forward rotate bring it in opening your chest hold this pose push it back rotate scoop it in great job let's do it again hold it here and push forward rotate your tiger's claw bring it in open your chest hold it here again and let's push back rotate your tiger's claw and scoop it in hold your position and now observe the transition from your tiger's claw into wellspring palms rotate your tiger's claw and from here let it go opening it up to wellspring palms and from here let's begin our dragon whips its tail beginning by focusing on the lower dantian we will do two on each energy centers last one for the lower dantian and now let's bring it into the middle dantian one more time and now let's bring it in the upper dantian one more great job now let's bring it back down into the middle dantian one more and let's go back down into the lower dantian last one great job now let's close for a moment going back into your tanjong let's close inhale circling up exhale push it down to the earth wonderful job great now we will do exactly the same thing but now we're going to do it on the other side you will just open with the opposite feet doing the same thing opening up to the tiger for this round feel free to do it silently in your own face in your own rhythm just finding your own flow Let's do one more tiger qigong and then we'll transition into dragon whips its tail. Ready? Push forward. Rotate your tiger's claw. Open up to wellspring palms and let's begin our dragon whips its tail. Again, two on each energy centers. Now let's begin to descend back down into the middle dantian. And lastly descending back into the lower dantian. And now let's close back into our tanchong. Inhale, circling up, exhale, pushing it down to the earth, releasing any excess sadness or grief. Again, inhale, rising up. As you push down, exhale, bringing in joy and happiness. And last one, inhale, rising up. Exhale, bringing in white colored energy. Now let's come back into stillness. First, opening it up to Wuji stands. Let's do our two gate breathing. As you inhale, feel the energy in your lower dantian expand. And as you exhale, feel it in the center of your palms. Do this for a few more rounds on your own, feeling the energy of heaven and earth connecting within you.
Now put your hands back into your lower dantian. And let's begin to pack the chi. As you inhale, feel the energy in your lower dantian expand. And as you exhale, feel it condense into a white colored pearl. Do this for a few more rounds on your own. Feel free to stay here for as long as you want, but if you're ready to end this practice with me, then follow. Begin to connect with the energy around you. Feel the air or the sweat brushing through your skin. Become aware of the sounds around you, the taste of your tongue, and now slowly relax your arms and open your eyes to wide-eyed vision. Thank you, my wonderful friends, for joining me in this practice today. I hope that this will help you find your flow both in practice and in life. See you again next time. Hello again, my wonderful friends. As you are wrapping up today's practice, I just want to express again my sincere gratitude and appreciation for your presence and work for today. If this video was helpful, I hope that I can ask for a small favor by clicking the like button so that more people can benefit from this video. Also, we post one video per week, so if you haven't subscribed or clicked the notification bell, please do so, so that you will be notified when we upload videos. If you have any suggestions or questions, please feel free to comment them in the comments section below. We try our best to answer them personally so that we can connect with you. Thank you again, and see you again on the next videos.